Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. So I have a little story for you. I recorded a tutorial, uploaded it to my computer. When I clicked on the file, it was only halfway recorded. This was my face. I figured, what's plan B? And plan B was my makeup collection, since it was um, really requested, honestly. Um, but there is gonna still be a disclaimer. No shape or form, I am bragging. Um, I'm just simply showing you guys where I do my makeup and what my makeup collection consists of in case you guys wanna go out and buy the same things. So enough blabbering, let's just get to it. Okay, so this is my makeup area. This is what you see behind me when I am filming. Um, this is just like as basic of a desk as you possibly can get. Um, I got it from Target and I believe it is called a basic desk. Um, if I can find it on the website, I will link it down below to show you. So let's just get right on in and let's take a tour of what's going on here. Okay, so just starting off over here, this is just my mirror um, that I use when I'm not filming and I'm just doing my makeup regularly. Um, it just has like a regular side and a magnitude side on the other side and it has like two mirrors when you open it up, but I'm not gonna get into all that because it's just a mirror. Um, and then it has like a knob and it gives you like um, different lights. Nothing really special, got it from Target. It was like 20 bucks. <laughs> um, but if you wanna know, I will try to find it online and I will link it down below. Behind that is just a mirror that I got from Walmart and I use that when I film tutorials. I stack it up in boxes and it works wonders so I can see what is and going over on. over here, these are my makeup um, brushes, makeup holders. These two are depotted Bath and Body Works candles. Um, and then over here are my face brushes, Sigma and Sedona Lace brushes. That's all that's in there. And then over here, these are my Real Technique brushes, all of them. Um, then I just have like some e.l.f. brushes back here. This is actually from the dollar store. And then these are my eye brushes. Um, I have some e.l.f. in here. I have some Sigma. I have some Sedona Lace. I have, um, this one is, no, it's not that one. What is this one? This one is Jabonske. I don't even know. But I got it from Ulta, and I love that brush. Um, and then up here, I just have some Vaseline Lip Therapy because I always moisturize my lips before I do my makeup. Um, this is just a duo. I brush, um, it has eyeshadow one side and crease on the other. Can never have enough crease brushes. And this is my little spoolie where I do my um, eyebrows with. Okay, so now getting into these bins. Um, these are actually from eBay. Um, I will link them down below where I got them from and stuff like that. You can also get them from the container store, but where I got them from, they're a lot cheaper than the container store. So um, in the top drawer, I'll just pull them out as I show you. In the top drawer, I just have primers. Um, this is my MAC Prep and Prime. I have my Benefits Professional, of course. This is my Skin T-Zone um, primer, and this is for when I'm oily. I have an HD, a Makeup Forever HD primer, Battle Rock um, Behind the Scenes primers. I have an Urban Decay eyeshadow primer, an e.l.f. face primer, which is really, really good. Definitely would recommend that. That is a great drugstore primer. Um, this is my MAC Prep and Prime Highlighter and Bright Forecast. You guys know I love that. I have an HD setting powder for my foundation. Hate this. Do not buy this. I'm telling you. Just, just don't do it. It's not worth it. I hate that stuff. Um, a Lancome eye, pri um, not eye primer, eye cream for when I'm having some bad sleeping nights. <laughs> um, and then I have a sheer coverage um, concealer. And I actually got this in a influencer box. Great, 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 um, what am I trying to say? Sample size, yeah. And I actually do love that. Um, and then in here, I have um, my Tarte concealer, my Smashbox concealer. Um, I use this, this is the same um, skin tone as me, so I use that when I'm having like breakouts. Um, I have a sleek face um, contour kit, which I'm excited to try out, just got that, um, a MAC. Palette. It was one of my face, my first um, palette, so I don't want to give that away because it's like, I don't know, that's what started me off on makeup. And then I have a Victoria's Secret palette, which I don't ever use. Um, eyelash curlers, which I barely use. These are e.l.f. It was like a dollar. Um, Urban Decay 24-7 um, eye sticks. Um, barely used them. 
sometimes maybe I've used them a couple times I don't even know probably didn't use them at all um, but they were a gift and then these are um, some Sedona um, eyeshadow samples down there um, that I haven't gotten around to using yet don't know if I'll use them they came free with when I ordered my brushes though okay and then down here um, I just have some elf duo eyeshadows nothing really special um, these are elf mineralized um, eyeshadows various colors and I have some bare minerals mineralized eyeshadows um, and these are color Maybelline color tattoos that I keep down here and I use these as bases and over here this is actually just a glass that I keep my dirty brushes in so slide that to the side um, up here I have my mascaras I have an origins mascara I have my Maybelline rocket which is really really good love that stuff actually just starting to um, actually just recently got it and I've been loving it Covergirl Clump Crusher, as you guys know, I love my um, Maybelline Cat Eyes, which is okay. It's not great, but it's not bad. I don't, I don't know. Um, Revlon Smoke Peach, you guys know I love that. Um, my Kate Middleton lipsticks. Um, Revlon Coral Reef Baby Lips. Oh, nice, Lauren. Baby Lips to moisturize my lips before I put on lipstick. And this is just like a Tiffany's box. I keep. Um, my ex my extra banana banana powder in there because it's easier to do that to pour it in there so I don't waste any and then product. In here I have my NYX stuff. Um, these are my NYX jumbo eye pencils. I have various cover covers, <laughs> various colors, um, purple and white and pink and green and blue. And then I have some eyeliners, some liquid liners, and then a Lush um, lip scrub, which is really good and it tastes good. And then down here is just hair stuff. over here I just keep my BH cosmetics palettes um, I have a 88 color palette um, I have a 28 color smoky eyes edition palette what else I have a 28 natural eyeshadow palette and then I have my BH day and night palette okay so now moving on to this section which sits on my big acrylic storage case thingy my bobber um, <laughs> Back here I just have some Bath and Body Works um, candle holders that I depotted. So I have, just have some tweezers, um, Makeup Forever HD Foundation, um, Wet n Wild Liquid Liner, um, MAC Fix Plus, and Travel Size can never have too much MAC Fix Plus. Um, my foundations are back here, my MAC foundations are back here, MAC Pro Longwear, and then I have Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray, which is really good. Um, and then a big MAC Fix Plus, like I said, can never have too much. And then I have my makeup sponges, my um, beauty blenders, and my Sonia Kashuk um, beauty sponges. And then some travel um, brushes. This is Origins, and this is just like a MAC. And then over here, I just have my NYX lip glosses. This is in Sugar Pie. Then I have one in Neutral or Natural. And then I have one in Beige. Um, although I don't know why it's called beige because it's not beige, it's like berry. <laughs> and then I have my Buxton Lip Gloss and White Russian, my Tarte um, Tint and Envy, my NARS Turkish Delight, NYC New York Lip Shine, and then right here usually sits my Revlon Bellini, but that is in my purse because I went out last night and I had to bring that with me. Um, and then over here, my most grapher mascara, so my MAC and Extension Dimension benefits their real Roma London's then lash. Over seller. here, we have my MAC lip gloss, my lap lip glosses, MAC lipsticks. I have quite a few. Um, this is Diva, and it just looks like this, like that. Hopefully, you guys can see that. Um, what is this? This is Viva Glam 6, and it just looks like this. Um, this is Ruby Woo, and it looks like that. Really pretty. This is Candy Yum Yum. Looks like that. Gorgeous color. This is Snob. It looks like that. Really pretty. This is Angel. Love this color. Looks like that. This is Myth, and it looks like this. 
And then this is, what is this, Please Me. And it looks like that. And then this is, what is this, Nikki, the Viva Glam Nikki. And it's a really cute, bright pink color. Okay, now so moving on now into the middle area. These are where my blushes are, my NARS blushes and then my MAC blushes. Um, this is actually, I use this as a highlighter. This is Nico, and it looks like that. And then this is, what is this? Dociar. I can't even say that. <laughs> oh, how do I open this? And it looks like that. And then this is Libre Day. And it looks like this. And then you already know I know this one is Dolce Vita because it's my favorite. And it looks like that. <laughs> Um, and then up here, I just have my MAC blushes, and this is Gleeful. Love that. It's really pretty. And this is MAC Flower Power. And then back here, I just have an Archie's pen that they had gave me when I purchased MAC stuff. Okay, so now we're going to get into this big acrylic case that I got off eBay. Um, so I guess we'll start from bottom to top. Sure. <laughs> okay. So um, back here not really important these are just like samples that I've gotten whatever it's like land clone Clinique don't worry about that um I just have something elf eyelashes some more samples more samples not important mascara <laughs> told you guys I was a mascara hoarder um bad gal lash I have some covergirl voluminous something down there um what is this some hypno star that I got a sample um, Hello Kitty, and then my highlighter, my Benefit highlighter. Then I just have some Durablend foundation, Durablend setting powder. Um, this is my Origins setting powder here. Um, I have an e.l.f. sheer powder. Um, nothing really special. Uh, Physician's Formula highlighter, which I hate and I wish I could return. Um, but I figure if I put it there, I'll make myself just use it for something. CoverGirl bronzer. I have some Dream Bouncy blushes. Um, over here I have some lip glosses. I have e.l.f. conditioning lip glosses down there. I have some e.l.f. twisty uppy. <laughs> I don't know how to say those. But they like twist up um, lip glosses. Um, some vitamin water chapstick, which is good. I love that stuff. Um, this is just like a... I don't know. What is, where did I get this from? I have no idea, but that's just a lip gloss. Um, an Urban Decay lip gloss that came with my palette, and I never used it. I hate that color. Um, and then, let me push this back a little bit. And then up here, I just have like two Kabuki brushes. One's Victoria's Secret, and one is Makeup Forever. And then I have my MAC Studio Fix Plus Powder Foundation for when I, it's summertime. Because nobody wants to be hot in the summer, but they still want to look good. And then I just have my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish and Dark. Um, and then my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish, Skin Finish and Soft and Gentle. My Ben Nye Banana Powder. And then I just have like some quads up here. This is like a Sephora quad, a Clinique quad. What is this? A Lancome quad and like a Rumble London quad. Okay, so now getting into this one. Um, this is where I keep all my palettes. Um, and also my eyebrow kit, my Anastasia eyebrow kit, um, my Naked Basics, um, I have a Wet n Wild one down there, these are my MAC palettes, well they're Z palettes but I keep MAC eyeshadows in them, um, I have a, my Urban Decay, my Naked 2 palette, my Naked palette, um, I have a Stila matte palette down there, um, my Lorac Pro palette, um, my Spoil Rich palette from MAC. Um, this is just like a studio, Maybelline Eye Studio little quad. Um, I have a um, Sleek Makeup palette. And then I have a Too Faced Matte Eye palette in there. Oh, and then just like a NYX sharpener for my um, jumbo eye pencils. Okay, and then up here... Um, I just have some random samples back here from like my Birch Box that I used to be subscribed to. Not anymore because it kind of got sucky after a while. 
Um, but then I have my double stick tape back there from Victoria's Secret. These palettes I got from eBay, they suck. It's not even no use to even show you. I use these palettes mainly to like set um, lipsticks. Um, and here I just have like a uh, eye smolder from L'Oreal. Um, my MAC Cole pencil. I have an um, eyebrow um, pencil. What is this? Steel eyeliner. An Origins eyeliner, Victoria's Secret eyeliners, e.l.f. pencil concealer, buxom eyeliner. A lot of just eyeliners over here. And they just kind of like fit over here, luckily. Um, I have a sample of a Tarte BB cream because it just reminds me to try it because I really want to try a BB cream for the summertime. Um, I have all my lip liners over here. I have Jordana. I have NYX. I have, hold on, Jordana, NYX, um, Wet n Wild, and I have like one MAC one that I use with like everything because it just goes with everything. But that's pretty much it. I'll just give you guys an overview of what it looks like. Okay guys, well that is it. That is my makeup collection and I hope you that you enjoyed this video. Make sure you thumbs up and there will be a tutorial up soon. I'm so sorry. I know I'm supposed to upload tutorials Fridays and Sundays, but that setback <laughs> was pretty major. Um, but yes, I will talk to you guys later and I love you oh so 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 much. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.